morning drive. All right, thanks, Jacob. Mardi Gras, St. Patrick's Day, and the spring festivals get pit pockets. Plenty of opportunities here, but some new technology is making it harder for thieves to get to your cash. And our tech specialist, Jerry Serena, joins us this morning to tell us about the eye wallet. That sounds pretty cool. It is. It, you're looking at it, yeah. and and the concept is very simple. It's a, uh, ver a you know, wallet styling hasn't changed in what 75 years. Yeah. It's always the same. What um, an inventor named Steve. Um, Kabuli came up with is to take a very hard case, it's available in three different materials, and incorporate it with Bluetooth and a fingerprint scanner so that, almost like a, a safe in a hotel room, you can't open it unless it knows, uh, it has your fingerprint uh, scan in its memory. Now, the way you set it up, you see it this morning, set up with a, U you connect it to either a Mac or a PC with a USB cable. There's a small software program that, like I say, will run on a Mac on a PC. You put in a password that you can change. You see it on screen this morning. And it allows you, I don't know if you can get a shot of it, but it allows you to scan and store up to 10 fingerprints. Now, they show it as wow. the 10 fingers of one hand, but you can right. obviously have different people. It also allows you to unlock it. And I'll direct you to the uh, table just to show you in case we have difficulties later. When you press the unlock button, the wallet locks right there. opens. So, it, it charges in an hour, and it will actually uh, stay charged for as long as 40 days. It has a second feature. It can be linked by Bluetooth to your smartphone so that if the smart wallet and your, and your uh, cell phone are separated by 15 or more feet, they will each sound an alarm, which I guess is a, an indicator. Uh, it alerts you. That it's, in my uh, mind, what it does is it will help you, prevent you from forgetting your wallet or your cell phone, because if a thief gets a 30-foot head start, and it's, it's and you suddenly hard. discovered. I don't know how useful it is, but I will demonstrate this morning. I will oh. tempt fate. I'm going to unplug it from the software this morning. Let me just disconnect it oh. and show you that close the port. So here it is. You can see that it is pretty much the same size as your wallet. This is actually the, the, the there are three finishes that it's available with. This is the one that's done in carbon fiber, which has an added feature. I don't know if you're familiar with RFID theft, which is when people can act. They're actually credit cards now that instead of having to be swiped. Um, just have to be held in proximity to the sensor. Well, there are actually people that go in the malls and troll for those things. They actually will can pass next to you and steal the information off your credit card. If your credit card is in this device, it actually is shielded from RF, so it prevents RFID. But I will show you. There's a button here that's the biometric thing. It makes a beep, and you do like that. And if all's right, there you go. It that opens, really cool. and you see that it looks like a regular wallet on the inside. Uh, it has a compartment for your credit cards, and it has uh, place for your driver's license, a clip for your money, and so forth. And so this one is done in carbon fiber, and I'm going to get ready for some sticker shock. <laughs> this one is $5.99. It's $600. Bucks. My but the prices do start at $2.99. They're available in polycarbonate or in fiberglass. The uh, fiberglass and polycarbonate ones are d available in a choice of colors and designs and so forth, and you can even get a leather sleeve. So again, um, you can your fingerprint or your spouse's fingerprint can be in memory. But the idea is if you have valuables or you want to store, you're concerned about having your wallet in a locker at a gym, or I hate to say this, but if your wife and uh, children are in a habit of raiding your wallet while you're sleeping, this is one way that you control access to your billfold. And tamper resistant? Uh, it is not pretty, that pretty. It's very important to mention that the, the surfaces are tamper resistant, There's but it's nothing that can prevent someone from getting into this thing if you hit it with a sledgehammer Hello. or roll over the car, right. pry it open. But the idea is that at least for um, uh, if, if someone does try to get into it, you'll know it. So if you have it like in a locker or a place in a, in a gym or a place where you're away from your wallet, you'll know if somebody tried to get in your wallet. All right. Thank you so much. Jerry Serigny this morning. That's really cool. You can check that out on our website. You can find all of his segments on our website at foxstatelive.com.